Jamie Foxx is born Eric Marlon Bishop on the 13th of December 1967 in Terrell, Texas. During his studies, Fox works as a stand-up comedian. This gives him a regular part in the TV hit comedy show In Living Colour. Through his remarkable talent, in 1996 he gets his own TV show, The Jamie Foxx Show. Meanwhile, Fox flirts every now and then into movies, but he still does not break through to the general audience. It, it, it's like this. It's like climbing a mountain and you keep checking to see, you know, what's going to hold me. You know, is it, is it this movie or is it, or is it this... You know, this publicity is it. The film where he finally wins popularity is with the thriller Collateral from director Michael Mann. Fox shares the screen in this movie with Tom Cruise, and that feeds the enthusiasm of this relatively unknown actor. You have an artistic director who puts his stamp on movies, and you know that there's going to be all types of buzz just because you're being in the movie, and then you have Tom Cruise who brings. When you go to London, when you go to Venice, everybody in the world wants to come see the movie. So I'm just along for the ride and just trying to make sure I don't mess anything up. For Collateral, Fox receives an Oscar nomination. In the same year, he even wins the Oscar for Best Actor for his interpretation of Ray Charles in the movie Ray. He can be seen in the war movie Jarhead and works again with director Michael Mann in the action movie Miami Vice. This is followed by another hit performance in the movie Dreamgirls. It's very risky when you win the Oscar and the projects that you choose after that. But if you choose like you've chosen before the Oscar, where you fit yourself in a beautiful puzzle, become part of this wonderful team of acting and excitement, all of a sudden now, what's the buzz now? Like Ray Charles is like, oh yeah, 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 but watch this, look at that, look at this. So now it, it, it does something magical. Maybe it sets the bar a little too high now, you know what I'm saying, which is what you want. You want to keep, uh, like I said, doing great things like this.